friends welcome back to my channel beginner coder so in this video we will write a hello world c language program using visual studio so i have installed a visual studio 2022 if you see here there is visual studio 2022 i'll just click on that and here it is a as it is a fresh it doesn't have any existing projects so it has an options to clone a repository, open a project or solution which is already there, open a local folder and create a new project. So for now, we'll just create a new project. And here if you see, we are seeing some components like type of projects, empty project, console app, C, CMake project, Windows desktop wizard, Windows desktop applications. So these will be visible. This list will be visible only when we install these components. So while installing a Visual Studio 2022, there will be an option to check these C++ related components and install. That's why we are seeing here. Otherwise, we won't see here. So while installing, you need to select a components related to C++. So here we'll just click on empty project and click on next. So just project name, key project name, location. I have kept it desktop and Visual Studio. So let's go there again desktop so the visual studio folder I deleted we just create again visual studio means we can name it any folder so i just select this folder so this is where my project will be stored and i will just click on create so the empty project will be created in our visual studio so we will be creating a C language file with hello world. So here if you see right side, we have project one which is created and under that we have different types of files. So presently it is an empty project. So we need to create a C language file. So as it is a code, we need to create under source files. Just click on, just right click, click on add and click on new item. So we need to create the file whether we need to create dot cpp file dot h file c plus plus class so as we need to create a code just click on code and let's see what are all the files available dot c plus plus dot h dot ideal def so we don't have a dot c file so what we need to do we just create a c plus plus file just double click on that the c plus plus file will be created so the dot cpp file got created what we will do, we just rename it. Presently it is source.cpp. So we will rename it to source.c because we need to write a C language. So now we can write a C language. Let's start with including the required things for printing and scanning. stdio.h and create a main method as a main method is the entry point for the c language and just use printf to print whatever we want hello from beginner coder and just save it so how to run just click on start without debugging so here so there are build errors like to continue no we'll just check what are the errors we kept printf instead of instead of printf let's save it again and again click on start without debugging so here build started you can see and here we have a pop-up where we have a output so here you can see hello from beginner coder and if you want one more print just add again hello from beginner coder to divide it just add a new line in the first print and just again click on run so here we can see again we saw the two lines hello from beginner coder hello from beginner coder so this is how we create a c language hello world program in a visual studio so in the future videos we will see more about c language so please like share and subscribe my channel and share to your friends thank you for watching